<laughs> this thing needs enthusiasm. I'll give it some. Welcome okay. to another episode of Nerd, Nerd Out. Out. I am Randy. This is Brian, and uh, we. I got a hold of the Walgreens. Exp exclusive Marvel Legends Punisher. Uh, first, my enthusiasm is so high because Punisher was on, we did a Marvel Legends like list. Remember that? We yeah. did a list. Yeah. And Punisher was high on my list. Mm. I like Punisher. Uh, I like Punisher with white boots and a white belt. Would you agree that's yes, the way yeah, to go? Yeah, he needs, this shit needs to be white out. That's yeah. a little bit of a complaint. Yeah, yeah, you know what, my, my complaint, we're going to get right into it, well, uh, is that I do wish his his brown pockets were white. Well, yeah, yeah, um, me too, me too. But, uh, yeah, I, I actually, uh, we have in, in, in Michigan, in Detroit area, we have something called the Woodward Dream Cruise, where people come from all over the world, and they drive their cars. They and pollute our beautiful they pollute Woodward our... Avenue. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And, yeah. Uh, and uh, you know, I we were taking the kids, and there's a Walgreens right there, and I'm like, I'm going to check out the Walgreens. Walgreens and uh, if I don't know if Walgreens are are Walgreens uh, everywhere in the world in I America so, yeah. okay they sell drugs in a lot of places they sell drugs in a lot of places yeah. so I walked in and there was two shining punishers and I did one of those like oh oh this is exciting so uh you know I texted your brother right away and he was, he was excited too good yep um I really really again I've said this before Marvel Legends is killing it they're killing it for a $20 action figure I, what, I think they're. I what think does they're, it turn into though? I can't. It turns out the into. It turns into a Punisher van. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 So you transform the, the arms. I don't get it. It doesn't look like you got to bend the legs yeah. and then you get them in. Uh, okay, okay. Um, yeah. Uh, he comes with two heads. Uh, the head that he comes packaged with is the one with the headband. Is this is this Punisher War Journal? I don't know, but I like that head without the band more than like if that just didn't have the headband, uh, it'd be perfect. Oh, uh, I guess that's a good point. I think this head looks like Charlie Sheen. Charlie Sheen is the Punisher. A little bit. Well, he's like the more like comic book look. I guess. Okay. Like, or it's just how I remember. Do you remember uh, the Punisher limited it... series though? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I think these look like the painted cover version. A little bit. The stubble. Yeah. Um, that's my preferred head. The the head without the headband is my preferred head. But I I kind of see what you're saying. If you took off the headband. Cause that's I, just I the Punisher I'm used to. Yeah. It sort of looks a little bit like Dolph Lundgren. Looks a little bit like 129. I get what you're saying. I don't like the headband, but it's a nice, it's a nice um, option for people who don't do want a headband. I think it's from Punisher War Journal. I'm sure I'm gonna get a lot of people correcting me that oh, it's from Punisher yeah, War Zone or, yeah, or no, something. I, um, no. I like the stubble head. Um, I I think the skull is well painted. Um, one thing I did notice is. I don't know if it's just the proportions, but it doesn't. Look, does it look like his legs should be like a, an, a like a little bit longer? Like, do they look like they're kind of like thick, th thick ankles? Maybe, or maybe it's just the yeah. I guess they do. Do you, do you know bit. what I'm saying? Like, yeah, they, they, or do you think maybe like ankles? Yeah, he's got ankles. ankles. Maybe, maybe the boots just need to be a little bit higher. Uh, higher, yeah. yeah. Like if he had like like pouches at the top of his boots. Yeah, yeah, sweet. yeah. I do, I do love that they gave him the white gloves and the white boots. It makes a huge difference now i'm gonna tell you the one thing about it that i absolutely am disappointed with okay and you can tell me whether you agree he comes with three guns okay it's unacceptable a white tommy gun unacceptable don't yeah. i just don't like it bazooka eh, really like one of three like how about like i don't know and then what is this do you know what this is you oh know. you know what this is actually this is not a tommy gun. what is it this is a street sweeper these are, okay. it's, it's a super illegal shotgun. Okay. It's a magazine fed shotgun. But does it look like a Punisher gun to you? Uh, I don't know. That's a good question. Sort of. I, I don't know. You I mean, kind of like it. All right. So maybe you give them that one. What is this called? Vicious. This is, remember Rock and Roll from G.I. Yeah, Joe? Yeah, that's like an M60. That's like okay. a saw or something. It's that's cool, just... but it's a little too big for like, I don't know. I, I think I'm, I like the Uzi, maybe yeah. an Uzi, maybe a pistol. What, what guns would you well, like? If you, if you're gonna give them this, this right. is like a belt-fed machine gun. Okay. So it should have the bullets. Ah, I see. And it, so it feels like sort of Ent like, like empty useless. without it. Ah. Yeah, and he's like, like, like obnoxious looking. But yeah, he needs a lot more. Yeah, he needs a couple pistols. He needs a couple pistols. He needs a pistol. Maybe a knife. Yeah, a knife. And a then pistol. and then an Uzi is good. And then like maybe Uzi. an M16. Is that like a reasonable like like yeah, Punisher gun? Yeah, yeah. But he's called. He's the Punisher. And like, he needs like he needs guns on him. You know, like holstered guns. Okay. You know what? I actually like them without the holster guns, and I, and it's because when you put the holster guns on him, and you you know is is when you start taking away the comic book look of him. He doesn't then he have starts, holstered guns. I don't think maybe he right, does he now. Doesn't. But like I'm thinking, like his first appearance. That's what I'm talking about. Spider-Man number 
129. Nice. You mm -hmm. like that? That's mm -hmm. what he's that's what he's here for. Mm -hmm. Uh that's what I like. I like his white boots, white gloves. I like I like the guns, but I'm not so so into like like trench coat. Don't nah, I don't like that Punisher either. That looks stupid. Yeah, it does. I look don't stupid. like that. Yeah. Um pistol. He needs pistols. He needs pistols, needs a knife, and could use like a smaller machine gun. I guess I guess something a little bit less white than this. Um yeah, I don't know what's up with that. That's a, I don't it's really a weird picture gun. him with that gun. Yeah, you know? you know, Deadpool also came with this gun. My guess is that they're just kind of like reusing these guns. Um, but overall, like, this is... God, it seems like... I hope there's Walgreens. I hope everyone has Walgreens by him. Because if not, you miss out on a really solid Punisher. And in my opinion, is the best Punisher action figure. What are the have. options for it? Like, um, They did the first Punisher, which was decent, but it's like the Toy Biz one. It's mm -hmm. dated now. And then they did the uh, Thomas Jane pouty face Punisher, and I, I like that Punisher. I hate that Punisher. I like that movie. Thomas Jane was the worst. I love that movie, movie. and I know it's bad. It's that's, terrible. That's a guilty pleasure. I know, but I still like it. I thought War Zone was a, was a reasonable guilty pleasure, and I like the Dolph Lundgren one. I, I, that's my favorite. Yeah, one. it's I just that he didn't the have the skull. He didn't have the skull, but other than that, that movie yeah. was that movie was darker yeah. than anything. It was dark, even to today's standards. It's dark, and I think I hate to say it, it's a good movie. But I, I will stand by. I will too. And say it's a great B movie. I will stand by and agree with you. It mm. is a great B movie. It, uh, it is B and it's foreign. Absolutely. So if, you miss something in like yeah, yeah. translation. It's just it's a foreign eighties movie. They just make movies differently. Yeah, yeah. yeah. If he would have had the skull, yep. I think it would have taken that thing up a notch in respect. But because he didn't have the skull, it took away that personality. But Thomas Jane was the worst Punisher. He was pouty, he was a crybaby. I like uh, I like the new Punisher in Daredevil. Like he's pretty hardcore. Well, yeah, he's yeah. the best Punisher. Ever. I agree. The only I thing I don't great. like about him is uh, his, his haircut. Hair? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I know. yeah, my Punisher needs to have a needs to have yeah. a spiffy sp Superman yeah. do. Should but be like, yeah, yeah absolutely. He needs to that. have a couple curls. Yeah, yeah. Um, but uh, this is my favorite Punisher action figure. They did a three and three fourth one inch one, which is pretty good. But um, in the world of comic book action figures, I think six inch seems to be the uh standard and the way people will go so i can't argue with that um it's it's a great figure if you have a walgreens by you go out there now and hopefully you'll get lucky and find one like me if you don't go go on ebay or whatever your sources and order it um it's a good punisher it's it's again um when your exclusives are this solid you know you guys are onto something. And, and Hasbro, I'm going to give you nothing but props for your Marvel Legends. Yeah, what the hell are you doing making this an exclusive? I Punisher is Punisher? an exclusive. A I good mean, Punisher. Yeah, it's like neither they may need, who? need to do him in a line or something. Yeah. Or like, you know who should be a good like exclusive? Like a Moon Knight. Because yeah, I love yeah, Moon Knight. Yeah, yeah. Like, but not everybody. Not though. everyone loves Moon Knight. Or, or Everybody would if they saw that. Everybody oh, would want it. I love because Moon Because it's Knight. a cool looking character. He is like, so that? cool. Sweet. Uh, was he? I think he was my number one. Um, I think Tiger Stripe. He Wolverine was until was... I read them. Oh, they were boring. I'll be honest, but with I love the art. Know. I love the art. I, I collected Bill... it just because of the art. Bill St. Kevitz was that who did it? Is he like the water painting? Yes. Yeah, and I he loved was, the like art. charcoal paintings and. Yeah, he, he was awesome. like he was like Marvel's Batman. He was so mm -hmm. cool looking. Um, yep. But that would make a good exclusive. Punisher is, is a big enough character. He's iconic enough where they could put him in the Toys R Us and Target aisles. Um, and you know he's no vi he's no more violent looking than Deadpool. So I mean they could have well, got away. There's him. not a lot of humor. With it. Maybe he is more. Ah, uh, I see what you're Deadpool, saying. Deadpool, he's sort of cute. Yeah, I, I guess mean, he's so. not, but he's funny. He comes with it. a taco. Yeah, the Punisher. Yeah, he comes with a taco. The Punisher comes with a skull on him, and and yep. he punishes people. Yeah, he not is. just true. Punishes. Punishes. Yeah, and it's like that's awesome. But he looks so cool. He does look awesome. I remember uh, being a kid, pre-Toy Biz, uh, taking Superman uh, action figures and customizing them into Punisher figures. Right on. Yeah, it was good. But now we have a good Punisher. Yep. Um, so go out and get this. Uh, articulation, real quick, I'll just cover it. It's, it's as good as your Marvel Legends. You know you know, you know what you're... It is a Marvel Legends. It is a Marvel Legends, right? You know what you're going to get. Uh, you're going to get a solid construction, good figure, good accessories. So go Hasbro. Do that with a neck guy, dare you. Uh... Okay. No, you're right. I couldn't. I couldn't do that with a NECA. But uh, I'm on a positive NECA buzz right now. They're, they've been. They've been treating me well. We'll see. We'll see yeah. how that goes. Uh, but the Mezco one. I can't wait for the Mezco. Mezco. I need a Mezco fix. Is that 100 percent? Yeah, it's 100 percent. But all the Mezco stuff have been delayed a couple months, so I'm gonna have to wait for my fix. Oh. Uh, my my doll fix. Dude. Well, that's sort of fine. The basement will be good then. Yes. You yes. know. Let's so hope it'll so. be. That'll be a good thing. A good. Basement warming. I think you're right. Treat, you I know? think you're right. 
Uh, please check out our Instagram, our Facebook, our Twitter. Please subscribe and like. We're almost at the thousand mark. It's mm -hmm. taken us a long time to get there, but we appreciate every one of you who comment and like. Um, Even send... if it's a dick comment. Yeah, you yeah. Know, fine. Sure. I guess we'll take a dick comment. As long as it's uh, towards this guy right mm -hmm. here. Nah, but everybody likes me more. Yeah, everyone does They're like all towards you, better. you I know. You, no, you, they don't. You're more liked. You're, yeah. you're a nicer person. Uh, yeah. yeah, so, and uh, check out our P.O. Box. Just, you know, try what it. What is that? Uh, I don't know it by heart. We'll flash it. We'll flash, we'll flash it. it. There yeah, you go. send us whatever send us, you want. Send us something to review, something mm. cool. I know there's a lot of third-party companies out there. We're, we would like to experience some third-party uh, Transformers. Uh, so until next time, nerd, nerd out! Punisher Bonds.